Yeah, that's quick select is way better than the uh, the the weapons menu. Oh my god, this guy <laughs> got him. This is it, the Protopet duplication room. I'm sorry I'm late. I had some trouble with the guards. No problem. You're just in time. Okay, let's see if this thing works. She is trying to tell us something. Bye now! Enjoy the Hygenator! <laughs> Remember, you bought it from Steve! <laughs> Steve McCork! Indeed. <gasps> now that I've sold my one millionth Hygenator, I can finance the comeback of the greatest superhero who ever lived! Captain Quark! All I need now is a new galaxy with a new fan base so I can rescue them from a new disaster! <laughs> uh -huh. I already knew, I just didn't want to spoil it. Uh, but, but, Sir, I do not understand. Mr. Fizzwidget! <laughs> He's pulling his <laughs> out! <laughs> this is bad. <laughs> Alright, just what? What is going on? <laughs> Allow me to explain. I'm about to save the galaxy from the protopets, and you are about to become public enemy number one. Oh, and two and three. Guards, seize them! Smile, it's showtime! <clears throat> Citizens of Bogon, I am Captain Quark. A loser. I come to you in this, your darkest of hours, to shine the flashlight of justice on your galaxy. <laughs> flashlight of justice? Oh. As you know, a living menace called the Proto-Pet has been set loose in your galaxy. But fear not, Boganites. I, Captain Quark, have caught the perpetrators. Yes, good citizens. These are the masterminds behind Megacorp's experiment with death. And now, with this, uh, super electro gadget I invented, I will end the protopath threat once and for all. That's my elixamorph. I invented... Oof. Ahem. Stay tuned, dear viewers, as I amplify the signal from this helix so thingy and render every protopet in the galaxy completely harmless. Allow me to demonstrate. He's a big boy. Does that Elixomorph actually work? It used to. I could probably fix it. Come on, Clank. Let's get it back. Nice. Oh, boy. Y'all ready for a boss fight? Haven't one done one of these in a while. Let's uh, get over here again. Oh, yeah, there it is. That's the ticket. Ah, there's the good stuff. Okay, I'm ready to take them out. Uh, we need a vendor, though. Oh, never mind. We're ready already. We're going to go all in. Okay, I guess I've got it all. Now, does he make the mini? Does he make also other... Does he also make other, whatchamacallit, protopets? I guess not. Oh well. Time to find out! I can't... I, now, I wonder... I, <laughs> I failed the, uh, the Drek boss battle several times. Gosh, we've come so far. I'm really about to beat Going Commando. Okay, let's do it! Hold up, try, try for quick select first. And then get a couple of these going. Oh my. 
Did that just blow up my turret? It just destroyed my turret. It does! It destroys the turret! His rolls destroy the turrets. I did not know this. Missiles? Okay, wait a minute. What did he just... Did he swallow my turret to make missiles? What is he doing? What are those things? Oh, whoa, hey. Whoop, not today, Zerg. It's gonna upgrade. I know it's gonna upgrade. I have faith in it. And jump. I can, you can do it. You can do it, Mega Turret. Upgrade. One more. Oh, that's it. Wow, gee. Oh my god, that deals a lot of damage. That deals a lot of damage. Was I already previously hurt? I may have already been previously hurt. I know this is a good trick against him. Oh. Ooh, okay. Yeah, that hurts him a lot. The slam. Slam a jam. Whoa! Okay, I forgot about that. Let's see. Uh, can we make another one of those? Okay. Uh, that's good. Woo! What is that thing? It's like an orb. Oh god, why are these guys out? Yeah, what is... Oh, look, it's... Oh, he's eating it! Killinoids. Gotta have him. Oh, okay. Do I want to prevent him from getting those? Yeah, we got this. Fire everything! Looking good. Time to nuke him. Oh, that one. Oh, he's he about to slam the arena. We're going down. Yeah, it deals a decent amount of damage. Probably more effective against large groups of enemies, though. Oh, I just got surrounded. Oh, and I was... Oh, and I didn't use my... Um, what do you call it? Oh, my quick select. Gotta utilize the quick select. We're just gonna keep throwing these out. There it is, yeah. All of the dabblage. Uh-oh. Got it just in time. And the killinoids. Let's get some turrets out there. As long as we keep the turrets out of the range of his um, roll, they won't get destroyed. Oh, we got this bad boy now. Blitz cannon. I might want to take out that tank. Whoa! Yep! Gotta take out the tank! Oh god. Uh oh, that's a bad spot to be in. I got two more of these left. Come on now, don't deny me. Tanks are everywhere. Oh gosh. Oh no. We're... Nope, we've still got one left. Too many articles on screen! Oh, please tell me that turret can reach the tank. No, it can't. Ah. Okay, we're gonna have to focus him down. Or else we're gonna be in big trouble. We need a hit. A big hit. Stop following me, you stupid little proto-pet. You're a menace to society. We got him! Woo! You did it! 
It's okay. This is the real Mr. Fizzwidget. Quark had him tied up in a supply closet all this time. Gentlemen, you have my most profound gratitude. It was nothing, sir. I'm just sorry we couldn't get the helixomorph back. Right. What do you suppose is wrong with it? I don't know. It could take months of research and... The battery is in backwards. Oops. Imbecilic to the very last. <laughs> Down, boy. I just have to amplify the device with Megacorp's TV transponders, and that should cure the other protopets. Clank? Uh oh. It's okay. I can fix her. I promise. Nice. And there it is, folks. I'm very proud to say that we have beaten Ratchet and Clank Going Commando. I do notice that, like, that protopet battle, it's a lot easier than the uh, fight against Supreme Executive Chairman Drek and his mech. It's a lot easier. And I didn't even have the Zodiac gun, the Rhino 1, or the Rhino 2, which I'll be looking into getting those. Now that I think about it, I saw the Zodiac, but I didn't see the Rhino 2. Maybe that's in a different Ratchet and Clank game. I think I'm thinking of the Ratchet and Clank uh, remake. Like the one based off the movie. But in this game, the Zodiac gun is supposed to be like... It's the big bad. You know, it's the big bad weapon. Like the Rhino was in Ratchet and Clank 1. But I'm proud to say that we beat the boss fight without the big bad weapon. And I also beat Drek without the Rhino. But, eh, maybe I'll grind someday for the Rhino during a live stream. And then I can bring the Rhino 1 uh, to this game and play some tournaments with it. As well as the Zodiac Cannon. So, what do you like to do for fun? Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> so, Awkward. what happened to Quark? I heard he was working at Megacorp. So, you fellas new here? You boys should sign up for the new Probomatic. That little baby cleans you something fierce. <laughs> I just got done testing the full body waxinator. I am personally sporting a smooth chassis, and there are no tags on my luggage. Could've went my whole life without hearing that. Catch you later. Subject 23A, please report immediately for crotchetizer testing. Well, duty calls. All right, fellas, nice and tight now. So you tested this, right? Oh, wait, that's why I'm here. <laughs> oh, one more thing. And then, of course, we get the rest of the credits over here. Good times, good times. That, this game is a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun playing it. It took, uh, it, it actually didn't take as long for me to get through this series as it did the original Ratchet and Clank. But then again, I've gotten better about my consistency. Uh, I still, I still missed this week's Monday's upload. So, I'll probably do a live stream here sometime soon. Maybe tomorrow morning. Um... For Epic, no, not Epic 7. I keep wanting to call it Epic 7 because I play Epic 7 so much. Um, I'm thinking of uh, Eternal Edge. I haven't played it in a while. It's been like a month, and it's the kind of game that you want to just sit down and get really into. And, you know, take your sweet, sweet, sweet time with it. But I, I really appreciate y'all joining me for this game, and uh, you've got some decent views on it. And I had a lot of fun playing it. A lot of fun with the weapons and everything. And the best part about the Ratchet and Clank games, at least up to Going Commando that I know of, is that the actual gameplay just keeps getting better and better. Like the actual... But then again, some people do argue that Going Commando was definitively the best in the series. So I'll still be uh, probably doing um, Up Your Arsenal and Deadlocked. Because those are the ones that I'm familiar with. But we'll have to see because... I play these games on an emulator, 
and I'm pretty sure my beefy computer can handle PlayStation 2 games, but the emulator itself has a, you know, it has some difficulty with some of the later PlayStation 2 games. Uh, and Deadlock was one of the last ones that came out before the PlayStation 3, but I'm rambling. Uh, but anyway, uh, thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate you watching the series. There's more to come. I hope you all enjoyed this uh, playthrough and the channel. And uh, just uh, stay safe, be happy out there, sit back, relax every now and again, and take it easy, my friends. And I'll see you in the next one.